I'm going to go too deep into stuff. Mm. But I put up a post on Facebook. And um, I'm only going to put it out there just for the people who are listening right now is like, just never give up. Mm. Just never give up. You know, when things are just so mad. Yeah. I have been doing a lot of stuff. Mm. Whether it's sound system clothing, YouTube, slusher, mm. family life. Um, a lot of people them over the past probably about eight nine months mm. have been coming to me on social media or calling me or finding a way to contact me and they're like yo how do you do it man oh I'm struggling right now you know I just don't know where what to do and mm. you're on social media and you're killing it with the clothing and you're killing it with the YouTube you've got the views and this and that and I always remember you doing a video saying, um, you always, don't always assume that mm. the person that's out there doing good business mm. is doing good. Mm. They're stressing. Just always <laughs> have that time out to show them where it's going wrong. And I mm. didn't do that. Yeah. I always kind of gave them like, yo, this is wrong. Yeah everything's good the, the, the showroom versus the workshop Be versus the workshop mm. and you know what um during that time the amount of people like i says over that couple of uh, about eight nine months mm. who was inboxing me saying yo how do you do it i want to try and get on this how do you how do you do all these things and mm. i was like raw you actually think i'm winning like mm. i'm showing you i'm winning but mm. really behind the scenes man this is mad stressful mm -hmm. And I was, I had to go back and say to them, you know what? You really have to just kind of balance your life. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like, like yeah. they're, they're, they're not balancing their life. They're just thinking like, yo, how do we win? How do we win? How do we win? It's not, it's like, yo, just take the losses, man. Because if you're yeah. losing right now, yeah. but you have an ambition to win, yeah. you're going to win. Yeah. But it's a... It was just that whole scenario where you, you came to me with that whole mm. that that whole scenario of saying, "Yo, man, mm. you think I'm I got puds and I'm doing this, and I'm good, mm. but we're losing, man. This is not this is what's happening, mm. and so forth and so forth." And and it was just a thing that I just it was an eye opener of showing um, this whole social media thing of everybody seemed to be doing good. Yeah, except for you. You look at other people's grams and other yeah, people's posts. Yeah, everybody. And, and you sit there and think, mm. they're doing better than me. Mm. They're doing better than me. They're doing better than me. And then you either get so downhearted in your own thing that you end up not winning. Mm, yeah. And I think that, you see that term, winning, it's, uh, it's ongoing. Uh-huh. And that's the thing. It's like you've got to remember. It's, it's a process. You know what I mean? It's like, have you won? Well, I, I don't. I don't know until I finished. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? But every day, it, you've got to have some wins in your day. Do you get what I'm saying? And mm. it's remembering that it's it's an ongoing process. Like you said, even the losses, you're getting closer to a win. Then, mm. do you get what I'm saying? And that's and that's what it is. It's enjoying. It's understanding that the process of winning is painful. Yeah. It's difficult. It's hard. It's been honest as well. Yeah, man. It's yeah. been honest because yeah. I really realised that over the past couple of weeks, it's like, yeah. yo, you actually believe I'm winning? Like, yeah. us here now chilling. Mm. We're only winning because we're only aiming for a goal. Yeah. That's the only reason why I'm winning, you know. Yeah. I'm winning because I'm aiming for a goal. I'm not mm. winning because financially I'm good or whatever. Yeah. I'm, I'm, you yeah. don't need to know my financial background. Yeah. It's, it's what you define I'm as good, winning as well. That's the thing. It, that's it. It's like, what's the, what's the, what's the what's definition? Your goal? You know what I mean? You like, just, I'm you... always going to win until. Yeah. I saw a picture today. It was um, someone posted a picture. It was Damon Dash and Elon Musk. Uh -huh. Yeah. And Damon Dash had this look in his eye like, raw. It, it, like, it's Elon Musk. He's like, <laughs> he was gassed to be in a picture with Elon Musk, Tesla, yeah. SpaceX. Yeah. You know what I mean? Where usually, if you see a man like that in a picture, he's chilling, and the person next to him's gassed. Uh -huh. And I'm saying, there's all, regardless of the level you're on, there's always another level to aspire to. Yeah. So people would look at us and say, "Yo, them man are doing this. Uh -huh. They've got they've got a business. They've got this platform. You know what I mean? They're doing this. They're doing that." However, when we look at our own circumstances, we're looking at someone else like Ra. 
I've got so far to go uh-huh. and not sometimes not appreciate where we are. Yeah. You know, and I, I'm, I'm guilty of it as well. You know I mean? I, I always have to remind myself that I'm blessed, man. I'm, I'm, I've got a family. Do you get what I'm saying? I've, mm-hmm. I've got life, I've got health. Um, yes, we've we got a business, you know, but it's in the, in the midst of it all, it's, you it's just get consumed with, I've got yeah. these brown envelopes from HMRC. <laughs> and nobody you sees know what these mean? things. But and this, in- is what I think, this is what, I, this is what I'm, I'm thinking, this is what I'm trying to show everybody yeah. as well. And, and I think you know it more than me. Is like, mm. yo, when you have business and you think things is running, you can put that kind of cool mm. aspect on it on Instagram, like, yeah, winning, chilling, mm. doing this and the other. But yeah. yo, there's not many that really start to say, yo, mm. got this bill coming in this month, this yeah. one's coming in this month, this month. And it's like, yo, the only reason why you probably put out like you're winning because it just keeps you motivated. Mm. Yeah, yeah. You see the other thing as well, on that on that winning point, think about like a box, a 15 round boxing match. You could win round one, round two, round three. You see by round four, you start getting tomped up. Yeah. You might lose round four, five and six and you're just like, rah. Got 15 pressure. R- pressure and then you have to have the people around you to say yo fix up yeah you I'd, don't have yeah. that per- you gotta have people around you Definitely. it's the same predicament you gotta have yeah. people around you to say yo yeah. dash some water on your face yeah, what are you dealing with man you don't yeah. remember what we were talking about yeah. two weeks ago yeah. uppercut this that and the other yeah, and then true. you come back again and, and, and really deal with the situation yeah. but you know what um, true, man. Um, I just wanted to bring that look a bit out just yeah. just for the early part because I know that certain people are going to be watching it and be like yo rah they get it mm. but we had a conversation which we didn't really talk about mm. I don't think we did which okay. was can you boss mm. in Wolverhampton? <laughs> you remember it? I do, yeah. Yeah. And I don't think we yeah. really talked about it. We've never really discussed it. We ne- it was always mm. going to be a topic that we were going to talk about. And um, mm. this is more for the people them who 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 are from Wolverhampton or from any ends that you're from that That's you've it. been it's, it's for a long time. Yeah. And um, I really have been taking time out to think, can you boss mm. in we're going to use Wolverhampton. Anybody that's watching it, yeah. just, just your own end. We're going to use Wolverhampton because that's where we are from. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to throw the question to you. Yeah. <laughs> Can you boss in Wolverhampton? Again, it comes down to your definition of boss. If, if we're speaking about like in the multimedia... Can you, can you make it in yeah. your own city? Again, it comes down to your definition of make it. And it, it depends what, in, what industry <laughs> you're in. Excuse me. So, for example, if you're... Would you say you you boss in Wolverhampton? Do you think you Okay. Again, it's 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 levels, isn't <laughs> it? Like that. Okay. It's levels. Uh-huh. So when I was DJing, when I was fifteen uh-huh. and I was DJing, I, I felt like I'd done everything I could do in Wolverhampton. So I had to get on a bus and go to Birmingham and then show Birmingham I can do this uh-huh. and then from there go to Nottingham and then go London. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm. So I felt like in Wolverhampton, I had, I'd done everything I could do in Wolverhampton. So, so I bus in Wolverhampton on okay. that level. However, in terms of like the the bigger level, because when we say bus, we're talking about you make a career. Are we saying, okay, let, let's set some parameters then. Are we saying, when we say bus, you have made it to a point where it's fully funding the lifestyle that you want, doing whatever you're passionate about, whether it's clothing, whether it's music, whether it's dance whether it's singing whatever is that what we're saying is i I, I kind of see it more like a, a, of like maybe of a just like how people see it like yo you, you boss if you're gonna look at it like that then mm. then career wise yeah do you do you like personally think you're a boss like yeah. if you okay then let's say let's say then let's talk about some people who we could say yeah, has boss. boss okay yeah <laughs> okay yeah. then so we say maccabee yeah you boss i don't know Okay, that's cool because yeah. I'm very glad that you even said I don't know. Yeah, Beverly Knight, yes, Goldie, yes, Denise Lewis, Denise Lewis, yes, those are the levels yeah. of a boss I'm talking okay. about. Yeah, and however, do that, you need yeah. to do that now to reach that level? Yeah, you know, you I see, with all of them people though. They didn't boss in Wolverhampton. That's Ex- the thing. Okay, you see. Do you get me? Where did they have to, they have to go? 
They had to go. They had to go. They had no choice. Yeah. So, and it's what I'm saying. Like, it comes down to the like, they done everything that they could do in the city, uh-huh. and for them to then take it to a bigger level, they had to go. Mm. You know, some of them went earlier than others. Do you think you can bust in Wolverhampton and stay in Wolverhampton? I think you can now. Definitely. Because of this. Mm. There's no excuses. Where before you couldn't. Before you had to go to the BBC or you had to go to the big city to get the exposure. You had to go to the record labels to say, put me on the platform. Mm. Where the platform now is right here. Yeah. So you can bust in where the smallest little remotest village as long as you're as long as you're presenting that talent you're going to find your audience your audience Mm -hmm. is going to find you and somehow some way it's going to rise to the top and you're going to you know i mean you're going to because because reach your goal going back to that the same thing it's like i don't think any of those people who we talked about actually Mm. bust here they didn't they was okay they They were known yeah that's cool yeah you did as much as you could yeah. But I don't really think you got the support mm. until you went. Yeah, and that's and that's and and, that's, and, and yeah. what you had there, you went. Yeah, and then it was like, oh, they've boss, they're boss. Yeah, like okay, and that's the thing, isn't it? Like if you say Goldie, mm. like for me, Goldie, he, I, I'm so inspired by him a mm. lot. But he didn't really boss mm. until he left. Yeah. But he left a mark, which was his graffiti. Yeah, it's like raw. He did that. That's the guy. Yeah. You know what I mean, and 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 and, and the, uh, Beverly Knight. I don't know. I I, I would love to sit down and talk to her. Mm. Yeah. To find um, out her journey. Yeah, because she yeah. she she says some stuff which I just I met Beverly Knight once, mm. and if I seen her again, I'd probably try and remind her about just the way how she dealt with the whole situation. Mm. Um, I'm dying to have a platform like this just to say, Beverly Knight, cool, but mm. I'm until I sit down and say yo. I'm not really feeling you, man. Yeah. yeah. I just think mm. she's a bit of a fake, man. Like, mm. are we gonna really put it out there? Yeah, this is a, is, is this a platform, is a pop, man. You know. You gotta say what you gotta say, man. Beverly Knight, respect and manners and everything, mm. but man, this whole oh, I'm a Wolves, I support Wolves and mm. blah blah blah. I think she's mentioned some sharps a bit, mm. but man. Wasn't she down here the other day? There was a, something in the park, wasn't there? Yeah, and she's she doing. Was... She she does a she does so much a lot for the city. But mm. I mean, when we're in these times now, mm. come on, are they, are rep, 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 rep a bit, man. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like like Goldie. Okay, then this is the difference because somebody could say, okay, what about Goldie? Mm. Goldie's totally shut himself off from the city. Mm. Like he even really, he's not gonna come back and be like, I'm Goldie and I'm gonna be at. Yeah. At, at Molyneux and I'm going to represent like go on K you he's know like though. he's done it he's done it he, he has done it he's, yeah. done, he's done the whole Burton thing and he's done yeah. various other things mm. and he never leaves it mm. but don't come and then be like do stuff that just irrelevant to who, mm. what you're about man like, yeah, yeah, man, like not, you ain't spoken yeah. I just don't get it I just mm. don't get I just don't get it man to be mm. honest yeah, yeah, I don't get it's her. hard, man. It's hard because it's like go and get some stuff, get some DJs, and yeah. get some people them who help. But, but the thing, this is this is what I'm saying it's now. This it's what, like this one can go out now, you know. Yeah, I'm like, no, I'm man. Totally going but it's it's a, it's a conversation. <laughs> I'm saying no. The the question for them is probably this: Why should I? Which is true. Like, and I, I remember having a conversation with Goldie, and he had me up, mm-hmm. and he was like, because I I reached out to him. You know what I mean? And he responded. We had a, a phone conversation. And he says to me, I've tried. I've mm-hmm. spoken to Wolverhampton City Council. I've said I would do X, Y, and Z. Do you get me? He's, he's spoken to Express and Star. They've said, you know what I mean? He's basically had the conversation. And it just never kept, nothing came to fruition. Uh-huh. Not by fault of his own. But why should he, and not just him, just anyone. Let's say, you know, we make something of ourselves mm. financially. Why should you take money out of your pockets and invest in a city that the council who get money from the government is not investing in? Mm. Do you see what I'm saying? Now, obviously, you, 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 some people would do it for love, just out of a charitable heart. They're going to say, bam, I'm investing 10 grand over there, 20 grand over there to do I this. 
Mm. That, that whole secret millionaire kind of thing. But when you when the council, and I'm not saying this is the case, but when there's evidence that the council is not doing its part, why should why should I subsidise what you should be doing? Why should I subsidise a youth centre you, and you've shut it down? I, I, I maybe because maybe you don't have to go down that route. Mm. Like for me, I for me, I would just look at myself in those positions. Yeah, and I, and, 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 and there's no way I'm going to switch. There's mm. no way I'm not going to. But for me, it was like okay then take away Goldie. Goldie yeah. was a different kind of scenario. Yeah, when, yeah. when Goldie was doing stuff, it's, it's a different it's yeah. a different thing. Yeah. But if you just go back to the same conversation, which is, can you bust in Wolverhampton? Yeah. So when you bust and you make a name for yourself, it's the way how you bring something back. Mm. Like, like you're an ambassador for the city. Kind like of if thing. you're going to do something, if you're going to say you're a rep city, like, okay, then this is why I didn't like, which, this is why I, I kind of not really feel in Beverly Night. Mm. And kind of like the same thing with Goldie as well. You're coming back to your city, that civic hall, mm. and then you have some warm up, warm up act yeah. that nobody knows, and you're coming from a city that you saying you represent. Mm. You was at Sam Sharp Studio. You literally can just go and tweet and say, "Is there anybody in Wolverhampton that I can come mm. and warm up my my show?" Yeah, yeah, Even yeah. if you have to a, an audition, yeah, yeah they I say, "You that. know what? Yeah. I can have her. <laughs> yeah, give them a platform. she could be that platform." Beverly yeah. Night has not given anybody a platform. Mm. That we, know of. Of. we don't know. We don't know. If, if we knew, it would be from, We'd know. It'd be from yeah. Wolverhampton. But, yeah. Beverly Night <laughs> not, she's not given anybody a platform. Yeah. You know what I mean? And mm. like, it goes back to, does she have to? Mm. But then it's just down to your morals, isn't it? That's, and that's it. That's it. Like, you're not going to... You're, yeah. you're from Wolverhampton, and who else is from Wolverhampton, Beverly? Mm. Like, yo, you know... It's just her... Like yeah. I'm from Wolverhampton and yeah. she puts on this Wolverhampton. I'm from Wolverhampton and it's mm. like, come on, man. Mm. Like I just. Yeah, yeah. It's it's almost like you'd say <laughs> this is what, a this what, is gonna go so left. It's just what do you expect from me? You know what I mean? Like what? Because that's the question I would ask. Like what what do you expect from me? You know what I mean? What 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 are you? What's the expectation then? So I've I've made something of myself. What's the expectation? What what do you expect from me to do? So if you're saying if I if I was Beverly Knight? No, if I'm I'm Tony Brown. Yeah. Of bus. Yeah. Your hype. I'm not. That's, I'm, no, I'm, I'm no, just asking. No, no, I'm, I'm asking. No, no, what what not, what do you expect from me? It, you're saying because I because as, I, I as, could do that as, as me and you as friends. I could do that. I don't know how you're looking at it. Like me and you. Yeah. Like I know you as Tony. I'm just thinking. I'm, I'm just like you, boss, and then yeah. you're gonna say you're like okay then. I boss. Yeah. From this platform. Gone. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm financially I'm good. Yeah, and because I don't live in Wolverhampton, you get me. I'm, I'm not living in Wolverhampton at the moment, yeah. so I, but I've got a couple. I'm good financially, but I'm not. And uh, obviously, you probably know my heart. I would give back because yeah. that's just my heart. Um, but let's say I didn't. Let's just say I switch. Like right, I, I ain't born in Wolverhampton. I, you know what I mean. They never supported me. I struggled in Wolverhampton. Well, she's not. I'm, forget her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's let's. Let's explore this. What would you expect from me? I've got, expect, I got a couple I, of mil. I, I, okay, then you got a couple of mil yeah. and you're just bust. I'm bust. Then I'm expecting you to kind of look and find yeah. somebody else who you could take on board and be like, you know what? Mm. I see they have talent. They have talent. Yeah. I can work with them and see. Mm. Like, there's no way if... If it was me and mm. I got like two mil, I mm. don't even have that, but I'm still trying to make somebody get somewhere. Mm. Like, so Beverly yeah. Knight came from Wolverhampton, I can't boss somebody for, she yeah. can't even tweet somebody and say, yo, check out this singer yeah. from Wolverhampton. Yeah, You've you know, not done that, man. And I yeah. think that is like, you can't even reach out to her. Mm. But when she comes to Wolverhampton, she's waving a Molly New flag and like, mm. yo, if Beverly Knight was here now, I say, name five members of Wolves. Mm. I bet she struggle. Yeah, oh, it would. <laughs> I bet she struggle. Yeah. Even if yeah. I said to her, who's the goalkeeper? Yeah. If you put her on the spot, mm. she don't know. Yeah. You it, know what I'm saying? And he's like, yeah. yo, but you don't remember Skyline Ring. You can't do pirate ring. You can't talk about them things there. Mm. Like, you just become... You, you, 
it's near it's near sellout kind of vibes, man. Mm. Like, yeah, she's mentioned Sam Sharps a little bit, but mm. she doesn't remember like certain things what I've what I've been hearing and that. And then yeah, yeah, I think it comes down to expectations. You know what I mean? She's living her life, and we don't know her reasons why, right. and we don't know what she's doing. See, I'm not. You know what I mean? I'm I'm, I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to save her. I'm just saying we don't know. Do you get what I'm saying? Like like I said, I, I reached out to Goldie on the assumption Likewise, that, that he ain't doing nothing. Yeah, yeah. I reached out to him like, yo, you know, these um these young people 